Welcome back boys and girls to another video uh, So my voice sounds a bit raspy It's uh, <coughs> just uh, I think it's probably just the air Anyway it's me Arctic Fox Gaming You all know mm -hmm. I'm Today I wanted to discuss something Not political for a change Now normally I would You know Gawk at woke culture And make LGBT community jokes But um you know, just because I can and there's nothing you can do about it. So, you know, stay mad. <laughs> uh, for today's video, it's a little different. And uh, today I'll be explaining a plausible and interesting theory about Winnie the Pooh. <coughs> yeah, our beloved honey loving yellow bear. So, there's a popular fan theory that each character from the show symbolizes a certain medical disorder which has been around since um, at least 2000 when BBC released an article I'll link that down in the uh, description for you so um, starting with Winnie the Pooh so Winnie the Pooh has um, impulsive eating disorder indicated by his near obsession with honey and his habit of counting of repetitive counting shows evidence of obsessive compulsive disorder or OCD for short. Eeyore, I mean Piglet, so I'm skipping ahead, Piglet has generalized anxiety disorder indicated by his constant state of worry and can often be heard saying oh dear. He has also developed an ear twitch which is a common sign in overly anxious individuals. Eeyore has depressive disorder, indicated by his bleak outlook on life and never shows any positive feelings like happiness or excitement. Rabbit has obsessive compulsive disorder, again, or OCD for short, indicated by his obsession with order and can often be seen making sure that his garden looks perfect. Owl has dyslexia and narcissistic personality disorder, indicated by um, that he has trouble reading. This is shown when he mistook the word school for skull. It is also theorised that he has narcissism, an inflated sense of self-importance due to his belief that he is wiser than the others. Tigger has an attention deficit at hyperactivity disorder or ADHD indicated by how he's always seen bouncing and can never stay in one place for a long period of time. Kanga has this social anxiety disorder this is indicated by how she is overprotective of her son and never lets her son make his own decisions due to her overprotectiveness. Rue has autism spectrum disorder, indicated by his lack of awareness to danger and has a strange attachment to sitting in his mother's pouch. Finally, Christopher Robin. <coughs> yeah, so Christopher Robin has schizophrenia, and it is believed that all the talking animals we just mentioned previously are manifested depending on his mood. It should also be noted this theory alongside similar ones like the Spongebob Seven Sins theory has been debunked as mentioned in a uh, article, again I'll link that in the description. However, this doesn't deter fans from finding new evidence to support this theory. Anyway, that's going to be it for this video. If you liked it, thumbs it up. If not, thumbs down, that's cool too. And if you want to see more content like this, don't forget to subscribe and ding the little bell. And thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the other side. Peace.